China has made remarkable strides in improving the quality of people's lives during the past decade. CGTN is airing a special series decoding China's past decade to commemorate China's achievements during the past 10 years. In our first episode, we focus on how big data is being used to eradicate poverty and build a moderately prosperous society. And our Xu Yi reports. This poverty alleviation information system has already collected 22.8 billion pieces of information on nearly 19 million people living in poverty since 2014. Every poor family registered in the system can be located geographically based on information about their income level and health conditions. Diseases are one of the main causes of poverty and nowhere was this more evident than in Xilin County, a state-level poverty-stricken region in the western part of China's Guangxi Zhuang Autonomous Region. Things were so bad that no doctor wanted to stay in the village due to the extreme poverty. Villagers had little access to medical care for a long time. Li Wenbin, a young villager in Baqiao village, Xilin County, has been bedridden since 2017 due to the debilitating pain from a shoulder disease. Everyone said my disease was very difficult to treat. I thought I would never be able to stand up. I was so desperate. Officials put Li Wenbin's information into the Poverty Alleviation Information System, which was then forwarded it to the National Health Commission. The program seeks to bring medical care to far-flung regions. Over the last few years, the central government arranged 118,000 visits by medical professionals to over 1,100 hospitals in the poverty-stricken counties. In 2017, a medical team from Guangdong province, which is helping Guangxi, came to Xilin County and found Li Wenbin. His muscles have atrophied so much, and we think he has a spinal cord problem. After confirming that Li Wenbin was suffering from spinal meningioma, the medical team performed a surgery on him immediately. The surgery costs were covered by Guangxi Serious Disease Insurance Game. Now, Li Wenbin has returned to a normal life after recovering fully from the disease. During the past 10 years, the poverty alleviation information system has helped many like Li Wenbin to rise above poverty. It will continue to play an important role in China's efforts to build a moderately prosperous society. Xu Yi, CGTN, Beijing.